Rebel soul child got a fist ball. I'm a respawn of ancestors and I'm black. What's going on? Welcome back to On The Cage MMA. My name is Brandon Eldridge. Today is going to be a slightly different video. We're going to be going through the most recent knockouts in the UFC. And we're going to be watching my reactions. I've been told this is a good video, so I'm going to give this one a try. All right, here we go. Of course, they start with this fight. Lovely. Look at that. Didn't even need the second hit, like the third hit when he was knocked out. That's ice cold as well. He didn't even need that. He was just doing that to get back in. Love a good slow-mo as well. Kevin Holland. Underrated fighter as well, Kevin Holland, so I remember watching this. I'm, I'm sure that was on the same card as the Adesanya fight. Was it the same card? Unlucky. Ah, oh, hold on. Hold on. I can never get bored of this knockout. This is the most perfect, planned, precise knockout I've ever seen. Obviously, being from the UK as well, Leon Edwards, my guy. Let's go. Okay, I'll play, I'll play, I'll play. I'll play. The slow mo. <laughs> Dropped. Headshot dead. Literally, I can't not smile every time I see that one. That's dirty. I don't know if you got knocked out from the knee, if we got knocked out from the fucking uppercut. Yeah, definitely the knee. Look at that. He didn't need that final punch. <laughs> look at it. Jesus Christ. That was a bullet. You can hear it like... His whole body flop when he did it as well. He was out. Even after he swung that, he was out. Or rocked at least. He wasn't out, he was rocked. For sure, but... That sounded like the guy was hitting pads. Like, Listen, let me, hold on. Can I t how long, how far is he gonna take it back? Oh shit. Hold on, hold on, it took it back way too far. Let me fast forward that. He took it back. This, okay, let me stop, let me go from here. That sounded like he was hitting pad, like, tch, tch, like a little, like, like a bullet. Here we go. We'll, re we'll have to rewatch it now, but. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Fucking hell. That's insane. This is why you don't mess with people on the streets anymore, because they just give you the fucking one two. Just like that. That was impressive. More of a TKO, but you know. It's all good. I still don't want to be in the cage with him. I know that much. Dirty. Yeah, he's out. He's out. He's out. He's out. I remember. I remember Steve uh, Mazagai used to get in a lot of trouble. He used to let the fights carry on all the time. Like the, the refs, the new guys that are coming in now. Especially there's a there's a British uh, referee. I forgot his name now. Um, he's really good at stopping the fights, making sure the fighters don't take too much damage. But sometimes, man, fucking hell, not needed. Lovely. Oh my God, he's not out. Can you just imagine like being on all fours, like you've been rocked on all fours and you just look behind you, you just hear this fucking six at one gladiator running towards you, knowing you're gonna get finished. Shit my pants, I would shit my pants. Bala Muhammad, do you know what? I, I never used to rate him. I never used to rate him. But he, he has impressed me. So, especially since he's been training with Habib as well. Yeah, definitely has impressed me since. Even before that, but. 
Lovely. Oh, like their pay was fun. I think it's some sun, mate. That's what they need. Jesus Christ. That's two of the whitest men I've ever seen in my life. Like two ghosts are fighting. That was lovely. So fast. Look at that. He had, he had air time. Look. Air time. And he got hit on the way down. That's so fast, man. I'm too out of shape. I can never be in this sort of shape. This is what I'm saying. It's, it's too much. I love it on the slow-mo when you see the face like all mixing about and shit. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That was disgusting. That was filthy. Look at that. Like, he didn't need the free shots on the way down, let's be honest, but... Look, the game's the game, all right? That's good. Referee's on him straight away. Look at him. Animal. Let's have that gladiator roar after that. Ah! Absolute animal. Free needs to face off the lobby out as well. Nice. Monkey King. Bit of a shit name, I'll be honest, but. Look at that. He's fucking huge. He's huge. Look at him. That's an athlete right there. He looks like KSI a little bit actually, I mean, it looks like KSI. <laughs> oh mate, that flying knee. I can't believe that's still legal. I mean I love it, but that's insane. Jesus Christ man. He dropped like a sack of potatoes. Yeah. Yeah. That was a good fight. And he's shielding himself, leaving his face open. The body gets hit again. Beautiful work. He covers up here. And that's a shot. His opponent would be sleeping on the can. Love that mullet. That mullet looks. Oh. He dropped, mate. Where's the slime? Look at this. One. It's not this one. Oh, no. It was the jab that dropped him, was it? I thought I saw him swim. Oh no, it was, it was. Yeah, left hand, okay. Fucking hell, man. So fast. I don't know what weight that guy fights him with. Jesus Christ. All the fighters with mullets are doing well. I loved it during COVID when there was no crowd, you know. Because uh, when there was no crowd, like you could hear like whoosh, 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 every single hit. Every hit you could hear. It was fucking beautiful. That's crazy. See, look, the CD2 hits there, they weren't needed. But I love it though. But they weren't needed. Look, one. He's out there. He's out. Look at him flopping. Yeah, that would miss. But just to make sure you got to give him the double tap, zombie land sort of style, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that's filthy. Yeah, that's it, that's it, that's it. Oh, he got back at... Oh, okay, no, he didn't. Ref should have stopped that, though. I feel like maybe third hit. Once he's once he's spooled up against the cage and he's covering up, he, he should have... Third hit in, he should have ended that. He's not even defending it. See... <laughs> oh, my God, man. Boom! Flew to the rod. I just took a shotgun to the face. Yeah, pure power, man. That's insane. He was like a wish.com Mike Perry. Ah, oh, and he drops him as well. I'll keep my mouth shut. Casey watch it and then comes and bangs me out. 
Jesus. Lovely movement. All in the hips, that one. Is that Bobby Green? I think that is. Lovely. It is. Terrible. Got my mic up here, there you go. I do love a bit of ground and pound. It's always nice when you get the finish on the feet though. Just out strike them, out work them, out maneuver them. You can't just throw punches, you know, you've got to have IQ in there as well. It happens in so many fights. That's one of the biggest issues with Michael Chandler, he just fucking, and Justin Gaethje, sometimes they just go for it, man. They can win so much many, sorry, they can win more fights if they just didn't do that. That was okay. That was okay. Compared to the rest of the ones I've just seen, that yeah, they weren't that good. That was lovely. Yeah, I was gonna say he took him out with a body shot, punched straight in the liver. Look at that! Boom, down. Couple of hits, double tap. We love a double tap. <laughs> He's a big fella, look at him. Oh, another body shot as well. All these unranked guys, not just, I'm not saying this guy specifically, but a lot of unranked guys, man, all coming through. Names we've never even heard of, man. So impressive. The talent, the, the, the talent of the UFC fighters at the minute is crazy. You have to be all, you have to be good at everything. If you're good at one thing, you ain't going to make it in the UFC anymore. That's just a fact. That was clean. That was so clean. That was the perfect fucking point on the jaw. Look at that. Dunk down. Does not matter how big you are. It's like a try that. I don't know what you're hugging him after. Or he's holding his head. Did he say the Mark Mendel? That's yeah. Yeah, I won't say anything. I'll just keep my lips. Lips quiet, I reckon. Keep my lips quiet. What am I about? Keep my mouth quiet. I'll just keep my lips quiet. That's weird. Yeah, look, you see, he, look, he knew he didn't need to hit him the second time as well. Lovely. Lovely. Body shots are effective. That's what I'm learning watching this video. These body shots are more effective than going for the head. Head's obviously a smaller target, so it makes sense. Oh, these are two big fellas. Gee, they look like they're down the pub with me. I didn't even see what happened. I oh, cracked him straight there. Look at that. Oh, and then the fucking uppercut. He looks like Taiti Yavosa as well. I know it's not him, obviously, but well, looks like him. Ian Gary, that's what I'm talking about. Look at that. Flurry of punches. Not a single one of them missed either. Yeah. He's on a great streak in a minute in the UFC. What a good fighter, especially coming in from the UK as well, man. Well, technically not the UK, you know what Ireland's like, but. Man. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Before I do this Paul Craig fight, man. Paul Craig was doing so well in the division, right? And then. He did this fight and I told all my friends to bet on him as well because he was on a winning streak at the time and I knew he was great at jiu-jitsu as well. Ah, oh, Paul Craig, what happened, man? You were on such a good run in the UFC. Every time he was on a London card, he was winning. He was great at jiu-jitsu. In this fight, I remember fucking watching it. He literally just laid on the floor and he just kept offering him uh, things to go to the floor. He kept, he kept getting him to go to the floor. And he kept just laying on the floor, waiting for him to come down and it wasn't going to happen. It was just, ah, uh, yeah. It was just annoying, man. It was just annoying because I know the potential that he's got. And he can stand as well. Why is he so scared of getting hit? It's his, it's his job is to get hit. Take the hit. Hey, I'll play it. I'll play it. Like this. Just let go of that point and back up. 
I mean, I'm just a fan, so what do I know about fighting actually, but it's just annoying, man, seeing one of my favourite fighters just get done dirty like that, when I know he's better, you know? Same thing happened with um, a UFC fighter from Watford called Sam Patterson. He had his first UFC fight. Uh, I think he has an Israeli fighter and he got he got knocked out clean, but uh, not clean, but he got knocked out, got rocked. Uh, it was just sad to see, man. It was just sad to see. When I've seen him at the gym. I've seen him at the gym, smashing everyone, everyone. The guy's twice the size of him. And he just he just went in there and he. I think he spent too long. Jesus Christ. That screw's out, mate. Look at that. He's out. But yeah, uh, yeah, Sam Patterson, man. So much potential. So much potential. I hate the fact that that happened to him. Is that Usman's older brother? I can't. The screen's a bit blurry. Oh, that was perfect. Animal. Animal. Yeah, it is, yeah. Yeah, it's Usman's older brother. I thought it was. Jesus Christ. Frack left hand as well. Oh, they're doing sap. Yeah. This is a hard watch. Ah, uh, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop the video there. Any more knockouts? My heart is racing watching all these guys get knocked out. Uh, I would like to sleep tonight. So uh, yeah, I guess that was it. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. They are not him. Tell him fess up. I get checked up. Hella carefree. Nothing scares me. Hella reckless.